I just got in and set up my new cap, pull-up bar, squat rack. I have no complaints so far. The only thing I can think of is I wish it were slightly taller. Even if it were a few inches taller, then my feet wouldn't touch the ground. But if it were about half a foot taller, that would be perfect. Now, if I'm doing chin-ups and I'm holding a posterior pelvic tilt to engage my core, really hold my core right there, then my feet don't touch the ground. And if I'm doing the arched back pull-ups, where I'm really trying to aim for that deep retraction and I do a slight anterior pelvic tilt, then my feet don't touch the ground either. So really, only when I go straight up and down do I have to worry about my feet touching so much. And even then, I guess I can just tuck a little bit. It's pretty light. Felt like maybe 40, 50 pounds at the most. But when you're on it, when your weight's on it, you're doing pull-ups or dips with the rings, it feels really sturdy. So I would only worry about it the stability of it if you're doing a muscle up or a pullover and stuff like that. So I want to try a muscle up on it unless it were weighted down. And it does have the pegs for you to put weights on it to weight it down. And on the sides, it has these little pieces where you can actually stake it to the ground if you want to go that route. I think ring muscle ups are better anyways. When it comes to body rows, if you want to do your body rows way out here like this, oh, you see that? Then you would have to weigh it down for sure. You'd have to get some plates and put the plates on or stake it down to the ground. You can, however, still do your body rows like this. Or if I had a chair set up, I can do the horizontal body rows, my feet on the chair. As long as I'm more or less directly under the pull-up bar, then it's not going to move. But, obviously when I start getting away from it, if it's not weighed down, then it's going to fall over easily. So, it's just something to keep in mind. Obviously, you're probably going to want to do body rows at that angle, because they're great. So... You might want to get some weights with this if you have it inside or put like some kind of sandbags or like a backpack filled with some kind of heavy rocks in it or something and set it, set it on the bottom, on the base. Whatever you gotta do to make it work. But just for basic dips, push-ups, pull-ups, and body rows where you're directly under the pull-up bar, it's great. For all the basics, this pull-up bar is awesome. You gonna watch me do these pull-ups, Jax? Really? Bell! Rhea! Rhea Bell! Psst. You gonna watch me do these pull-ups? Yeah! Yeah! Jax! You gonna watch me do these pull-ups? Okay, cool. It's better, I guess.